Police want you to be on the lookout of a new scam you could see at your local gas station. I just reported Brianna Fernandez is live in Denver. Brianna, what exactly should people be on the lookout for at the gas station? So it is a simple, tiny hole that you probably won't even notice that it's there. So police say what scammers are doing now is that they're drilling a hole to the sensor where you tap your card to pay. So scammers are getting very creative. So let me show you. Come take a look at your screen. This is what police say that you should be on the lookout for. Aurora police say that damaging the tap to pay option forces you to swipe or insert your card instead. But those options can be bugged with a skimmer. So police say thieves are now able to plant skimmers quickly, sometimes in as little as 12 seconds seconds and you won't even know it's there. So the good news is the Aurora Police Department and several other agencies that I asked Boulder, Arapaho and the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office, they haven't dealt with something like this so far, but they say it's only a matter of time. Whenever you come up with something to help protect people like contactless payments is that's what they're designed for. Uh, the bad guys will come up with something, some way to defeat it. This one happens to be a very simple way. Just drill a hole in it and they've got you going to the swipe. So simple. It literally takes 12 seconds. So I did ask the detective if he's seen something like this, this scam in other states. And he says that the only scam that he knows about something similar to this happened in California. So again, he wants you guys to be aware. So if you do come to the gas station, you see a little hole in that sensor. You're asked to call 911 and of course, let the gas station know so they can shut that uh, gas pump immediately. And another good tip is don't pay with your debit card. Mm -hmm. Corey, Jordan. Yeah, definitely something we're all going to be on the lookout for now. Tell your friends and family. All right, Brianna, thank you.